Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I do appreciate all of you um, for watching and commenting and today I am making a colour glue book. So um, the idea for this came from Nicole at Relax Cut Glue. I'll leave a link to her channel in the description. If you like gluing, don't miss her. She is hilarious. She's so funny. And honestly, it's just so relaxing just watching her glue. So I'm going to have a go at this. Now, she's got, um, I think she's using a art book or a, um, oh, what's it called? You know, the one with the lines in, just an ordinary exercise book. And I thought, I'm going to use what I've got which is one of these old magazines. This is from 2018. So I'm quite happy. I've cut a few pages out. So what all I've done so far is gone through, and as you know, these are really thin. So I've glued two pages together all the way through and then counted what I've got. Now, I, I tried to work out how many colours I'd like on each page. So... But that didn't really work. So I'm just randomly gluing them all in now. <laughs> so I'm going to drag you along with me. So all I'm doing at the moment is putting down colours down the edges of my page. So I can see what page is which colour. Which is something Nicole did. I am shamelessly copying you, Nicole. It is such a cool idea. I love your blue book ideas. So I am very sorry that I am just a copycat. <laughs> but, you know, you shouldn't have such good ideas that everybody wants to copy you. So I am just going to pop these on here. So let's say I've done one. You see, there's two pages. I haven't glued them properly. I've just put them together so I knew where I was. And you just cut strips of coloured papers that was a mammoth epic. I, I was going to show you how I found them all, but I mean, it, it would have took a little while. So I'm quite glad I didn't because I think you might have been a bit bored. It was my, I've got to stay above this line. I've drawn a line so that I don't go down past my lines. I've got my fleece on again. It's a chilly day today. It's winter in the UK. And it's always cold. Right, so I want another blue one. Now I've gone light, dark, light, dark, but it doesn't really matter. I've just cut strips from other magazines. So I am really using up my magazine stash. We're going to have to hope that I can get some more. I have actually ordered some off eBay. <laughs> I'm getting so desperate. <laughs> but... um. Yeah, I've ordered, I don't know if you've ever heard of it, Funky Magazines. They're, um, I think they're Australian. Tell me if I'm wrong. But they, they're they like um, some sort of art magazine. And I thought, somebody was talking about them. And I thought, ooh, that sounds, that sounds good. And there was somebody selling some for, I think they were $1.99 each. And um, I think it's cost me £6 for two magazines with the postage. So I hope they're good. Right, this is another purple page. So what I've done is I've gone through and I've put one, one colour on so I know what I'm doing. Because while I'm talking, I'll probably forget what I'm doing. <laughs> and I'll end up having like six purple pages. Obviously my favourite colour. A lot of you might think it's pink. But no, no, it's really purple. I mean, I like all colours, except yellow. I'm not that keen on yellow. Don't know why. It's very strange, isn't it? A lot of people love yellow because it's like, you know, spring and... I'm so bad with yellow, I won't even have yellow flowers in the garden. <laughs> How crazy is that? Mental, isn't it? But, you know, that's just the way we are. 
and I've got three pages of some and two pages of others mainly because I don't think I'm going to do a lot of probably oops um I don't think I'm going to do a lot of red I don't really I couldn't really find any red to do the pages page edges with so I think that might be quite tricky so I've only done like a page I think of red um this is supposed to be pink but that was another tricky one to find but now I've found some so we're gonna I'm just gonna add some of this on so yeah this is more of a when I'm doing my glue booking I think it's gonna be more chatty videos than anything else isn't it we're just gonna chat well I'm gonna chat and you're gonna get on with what you're doing I guess but yeah, it's, it's just quite relaxing. I can't wait to start this. I was so excited when I saw it. At first, I didn't think it was going to be what I wanted to do. But the more I watched Nicole and she was like just so excited to be doing it, I thought, hmm, there's something in this. So I'm like, right, do you know what? I'm going to have a go. It's only paper. It's just paper. At the end of the day, I need some more pink. I've cut out some strips, but now I need more pink. Have I got any more pink? Pink was a hard one to find. It really was. Funny, isn't it? Now there's pink on here. <laughs> and that's actually pink, so I could leave it. But then that's not on that side. I'll leave it for now. Um, right, where am I? Grey. I quite liked a grey page. I thought that would be quite interesting. And um, instead of doing black, I'm doing black and white. Because I think that would be quite cool. I don't want my pages to be all black. I don't think that would look very good. Well, depends. I suppose you could have shades of black. But I quite like the grey idea. Ooh, I found some more yellow. Did I need yellow? I know I needed yellow somewhere. That's a long piece. Yeah, I so couldn't find any um, red. So I have ended up using tissue paper, which of course is not popular, is it? We can, we can use, we'll use whatever you've got. If you've got children's book pages, that might be a good, you know, just to edge your pages so you can see where your colours are. And I'm really sorry, I do keep going off screen. But you can see what I'm doing. Um, I'm on brown. Now. <laughs> I think I had trouble finding some brown ones as well. Isn't it funny how the colours you think are going to be really easy to find are actually quite tricky. I think I cut out... There we go. Um... This one, I think. So what I thought was this could be brown. And that's that's all I that's all I've done really. <laughs> like that. That's the extent of the skill needed for this one, which is good. We always like a um an easy an easy gluing game game um let's flip that round to the other side of course this is just prepping your book the fun comes well not that this this is quite fun actually i've never done this before but it, it will strengthen the edges now i have a multicolored page here so i need another multicolored piece I think Nicole called it a rainbow page. So we'll see if this one... Let me just flip that one over. Okay. <laughs> sticky, sticky, sticky. <laughs> ah, yellow. Right, I did have a little bit more yellow, didn't I, to top that page off with. I had run out of yellow. I could not find yellow. Very strange, isn't it? 
You would think that yellow would be quite easy. Maybe, maybe if you've got different books than what I've got. Because <laughs> most of this is just out of, all this mainly is out of magazines. I think this is out of a book because I've got desperate uh, to open books and cut edges off my books. <laughs> no, mad, mad. We're all crazy here. To Alice. So you can choose whatever colours you want. I'm just, I've chosen like all the colours. <laughs> but you can, you could do sort of, you could do flowers on one, couldn't you? Or, um, you know, anything really. Right, this should be the black and white one. And I know I've got one because I've cut it out somewhere. <laughs> Come on, where are you? There he is. So it was just words. And I thought that would be... So I'm doing a, a black and white couple of pages as well. But how fun is this? I'm so looking forward to starting this. <laughs> this was the one I, I wanted to... I wanted to finish doing my glue book for the year. Last year. Finally done. And start doing this. So it, you know when somebody says, oh, this is going to be really fun. And you're like... Yes, I want to do that. Um, this is orange. Now, I'm having a bit of trouble with my orange and red. I think I'm going a bit colour blind because I couldn't decide whether this was orange or red. So I'm going with orange because another tricky colour to find. And I don't think that's orange, so that can go in the bin. And we'll cut down, we'll cut down this side. What I'm going to do is cut from the centre. Oh no, a bit fussy. Probably don't need to be this fussy. But you know, this, these are my edges. Yeah, really quite enjoying this. So big thank you to Nicole. I know she'll get a kick out of somebody else doing one of her glue books. So if you don't if you don't subscribe to her, just just go and have a look because she's she's quite funny. <laughs> she makes me giggle. Um Oh, I have more multicolour. I think I was going to do this as like a retro. You know, like all the old, the old colours. One of them was and one of them wasn't. Now I don't know. I'm going to put that on anyway. I can have two multicoloured pages if I want. It's mine. <laughs> Sound like a child. I can do it if I want. Look at these. These are already in the album in the album in the magazine so i don't even need to do these pages they're like that is a brilliant background from this is why i wanted to do multicolored sorry i'm rabbiting away so multicolored pages as you can see i've cut some out for some reason but yeah what a background already i'm gonna have to put something down that one down that side i haven't got and red was my last one so that's got to go down there. And this is this is what I'm using this this paper because I haven't got anything else. <laughs> so we're gonna have to. I tried to glue that and it just fell to pieces. So we're just gonna glue and put this down. I think I went a bit over the board with prepping the um, pieces. I didn't want to be here cutting like strips. For everything or what you know make you have to watch me do all of this because you know it might have been a bit might have been a bit tedious just chop them off so those are all extra now that i did have one missing didn't i that was was that multicolored one that 
page before. You just need something down this one. Not quite what I'm looking for. I really wanted something quite vibrant. You see, this this is what I mean by retro. You know, this this sort of brownie orangey sort of colour. Did I do brown? I'm sure I should have done brown at some point in here. Oh yeah, there. Um, see, when I cut those out, they looked much more, much brighter on the page. And then I cut them out, and they didn't look so bright. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with these because you know it doesn't really matter, does it? We like just just playing, just having a bit of a play. And the other side is is quite colourful already, isn't it? <laughs> so there we go. And so that's all my edges, I believe. Now my hands are completely sticky. I'm going to have to think of it because I can't keep going and washing my hands all the time. Okay. Loving this glue, by the way. Might might do an Amazon thing. Right. So, there we are. Obviously, we're going to have to cover, do the front cover at some point. And put some cute on there. Because, you know. Maybe we could just use some of the bits we've already got. Although I did see, what did I see that I thought was really cute? See these, this comfort. I thought that would be quite cute in the front. <laughs> Is that just me? Is it just me that thinks that's like really sweet? Yeah, probably. <laughs> and then I'll just cover these up. That's what I thought. Right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna cut the edge off. Obviously, it's a bit tacky. Did I cut enough? Yep. Oh, didn't go very straight. Me and straight cutting just not gonna happen, is it? Maybe, maybe that's it. Right, I might put that on with, I'll put it on with this, see how it goes. It'll probably come off with, um, with the amount of times I'm going to be uh, opening and shutting this, but we'll see how we go. We'll see how the glue stick holds up. Okay, <laughs> everything is sticky. So I'll put the first bit down and then I'm I'm gonna do this and just do the rest. I don't know. I don't know whether this will work. If it doesn't, we'll just put something else on. A mob podge it or something. Might mob podge it, that'll keep it on. Once I've once I've decorated it. And we need something on the back. And I found this lovely where was it this lovely door i like i don't know i've got to think about doors look at that how cute is that so that's going to go on the back the back door the exit for when you've had enough madness and i'm just going to cover up the whole page with it because oh that's quite nice though <laughs> um because if i if i do this then i can just add some more bits over the top, like on the front, and it will look really cool, hopefully. Hopefully. I don't know. I'm winging it, guys, winging it. I don't know what it's going to look like, to be honest. I know I'm going to get glue all over my sleeves if I'm not careful. Right, let's put my lid on. So, there we are. Just a quick start off to my colour glue book. So 
So all we've done, magazine, two pages together, and then put colours down the edges. And then we're just going to glue anything we find that's purple is going to go on this page. Anything we find that's green will go on this page. I know I've got purple there and green there, but I don't mind. And then it'd be green and pink. It's going to be very colourful. Very colourful. Oh, I do need some more pink down there. Is that pink? That's purple. So I'm going to go and dig through my um, my stash. See if I can find a bit more pink. And get some elements that I've cut out previously. Previously. And... I will come back and do another instalment if you like it let me know and if you don't like it don't say you don't like it <laughs> um if you don't want to watch things like this let do let me know because you know i can just do this in my own time but if you want to watch and chat away with me because i don't know about you but i do answer people when they're on videos <laughs> even though they can't hear me. So I'm going to go and have a little play in this and then I'm going to come back and show you what I'm up to, if you're interested. OK, thank you so much for sticking with me. And I'm super excited to start this and see what all the fuss is about. So thank you. I will see you all very soon. Goodbye for now.